Hello everyone! So in this video, I will going to teach you how to implement a small network using a Cisco packet tracer. So we have here the addressing table and also the objectives which is in part 1. We are going to create the network topology and then in part 2 we are going to configure devices and verify connectivity. So, <clears throat> before we proceed, we also have here a, an instructions, which is in part 1. Uh, we need to create the network topology. So, step 1, obtain the required devices. So in A, uh, in, it says here that we need to click the network devices icon in the bottom toolbar. So over here, network devices, and then click the router icon in the sub menu. Router. So. Here, right here, right here. And then the next step is to locate the 1941 router icon, then click and drag the icon for the 1941 router into the topology area. So Kane, si 1941, i-drag na to the rea sa aton topology area. Then proceed to sa next nga step, which is, then click the switch entry in the sub-menu. Switch. So, ne. Then, locate the 2960 switch icon. Then click and drag the icon for that 2960 switch into the topology area. So we're going to find 2960. So then you drag na to the ray. Then in step F, repeat the step above so that there are two 2960 switches in the topology area. So we need to put two switches. Then proceed to the, to the next step, which is in, to click the end devices icon. And end device icon. Then locate the PC icon, drag two PCs to the topology area. So, we're going to drag two pieces in the topology area. Locate, uh, arrange the devices into a layout that you can work with by clicking and dragging. So, step two, <laughs> name the devices. The devices have default names that you will need to change. You will name the devices as shown in the addressing table. You are changing the display names of the devices. This is the text label that appears below each device. Your display names must match the information in the addressing table exactly. If a display name does not match, you will not be scored for your device configuration. Click the device display name that is below the device icon. A text field should appear with a flashing insertion point. If the configuration window for the device appears, close it and try again, clicking a little farther away from the device icon. Replace the current display name with the appropriate display name from the addressing table. Then repeat until all devices are named. So, we're going to refer 
the names of all the devices here in the addressing table. So, the router is RTA, then copy lang na to. Then, select all B. Then, switch one is copy lang na to. Paste. So, same with here. And, switch two. So, this copy, copy, PC1, OC, PC2, so after na to umahuman, o rename tanan, We'll proceed to step 3 which is to connect the devices so it says here that click the orange lightning bolt connections icon in the bottom toolbar so okay ne. so just the connections then locate the copper straight through cable icon it looks like a solid black diagonal line to connect the devices click the copper straight through cable icon and then click the first devices that you want to connect then select the correct port and then click the second device, select the correct port and the devices will be connected. So connect the devices as specified in the table below. So click in auto. Then see can you see up this Then, I connect na to ni si router. So, in Mandarin, ha? Gigabit Ethernet 0 to Gigabit Ethernet 1. Then, butang na po taglayan na copper straight through Gigabit Ethernet 1. So, Gigabit Ethernet 1. So, Para lang gyapon sa switches, pero ang ato lang is follow ta sa addressing table which is in fast internet 1 add to ni fast internet 0 So same sa PCAS, fast internet 1 to fast internet 0 So nahuman na na to sila o nahuman na na to ang step 3 Connect the devices, so we we'll proceed that as a per part 2, which is to configure devices. Nata. So, step 1 configure the router. So, these are the steps to configure uh, the router. So, we click lang nato on this router. Then click the array, enter. Then move the tag en as in enable. Then conf shortcut lang may sila sa configure terminal. Then usap pa tama mo butang og host name. Host name which is si RTA. Then enable. Secret class, a secret Cisco line pa fifty five. No, 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 enable secret Cisco in pa fifty five. Then interface. Gigabit Ethernet Nabali Ethernet Zero so Description Connected to switch one port 
one then IP address ang ato din gamitan nyo IP address dili is katong dapat na tong sundon is katong to as a addressing table so five yung submit mask enter then no shutdown enter again then exit this interface gigabit ethernet gigabit ethernet one then description So, alida lang nina to si Jao 2. So, same Japan. Ha? Then, ang iyang IP address. Alida lang nina to si Jao 20. Which is, katong to as address in table. Then, no shutdown. No shutdown. Enter. Then, after that, ada banner MOTD si an author, authorized access is prohibited. Yeah. Unauthorized is prohibited. Enter line con zero. Enter then yung password na Cisco line pa fifty five. Login then line. BTY04 and password same lagi po ng password log in na ta log in then end then enter copy and start so, so after na to mahumano configure sa router as you can see ang completion is uh, in 51% na so step 2 configure switch sw1 and sw2 so it says here uh, configure the default management interface so that it will accept connections over the network from local and remote hosts use the values in the addressing table configure an encrypted password using the value in step 1a above so, first, the return is switch, switch one. So, enter, same gap on en, const t, then, ang iyang host name, this is sw1, then, Enable secret Cisco Inpa Inpa fifty five interface VLAN one then the IP address ten dot ten dot ten that too. 
two five five the two five five the two five five the zero then no shutdown enter then the IP default gateway then the ten the ten that one line gone zero then the password Cisco line five fifty five enter then log in then after line bty04 and again password log in again then end enter copy run start so then we proceed na ta sa switch or SW2 same process gapon nalagag yun nagman changes but same as long process sa pag configure host name SW2 then Enable secret secret Cisco Inca fifty five and then interface Pila one. So same job one and IP address. Then the ten that twenty that two two five two five five two five five that's zero and no shutdown then young IP default gateway then that then that twenty that one then banner in OTD C and author and authorize Authorized access prohibited. So, nalay sudden changes. Line con zero. Password Cisco Line fifty five. Then log in. Then line BPY 04. Password. Then log in inside. Then line BTY 515. Then log in. And copy run start. So we're done. So in step three, 
it says here that we need to configure the hosts configure addressing on the hosts if your configurations are complete you should be able to ping all devices in the topology so before that let's check if sakto ba ang atong pag configure so dili a uh, Katakabutang ng IP address. So, butang pa. So, let's try if makaping na bata. Terminal. Mm -hmm. Ping ten dot ten dot ten one. So request time out. Let's see. Hindi pa tayo naka... Gateway ten dot ten dot ten dot one. So same with the other PC. Butang tau IP address ten dot ten dot twenty dot three. Tab and submit mask. Zero tab ten ten dot twenty dot one. Then try not to ping on sila ogotro. So ping ten dot ten dot ten dot. So, press now. Time out and ping at the certainty that one. So, now. So, as you can see, na receive ni ang ping sa pikas nga kaan, then yung reply siya. So, send is 4, then receive 4, and notes. So, that's all. It's, and also, as you can see, completion is at 100%. Then, if you check the results, then go to the assessment items so nakuha na to tanan mga requirements then i hope you i hope you learn and thank you for watching